Hi guys, it's Danny the Traveler, and I'm with Rocky the Traveler, of course. And welcome to another episode of the Rocky Roadshow. We finally made it to Glasgow, and the sun is shining. We're outside the historic People's Palace, admiring the beautiful fountain called the Dalton Fountain, and we're getting some much needed sun. Today, we're going to be tourists in Glasgow. We've been here before, but that was a long time ago. And now we're back as we've been invited to our first ever Bull Terrier Walk, which will be in this very park, Glasgow Green. Check out this beautiful building called the Templeton Building. And remember this little brewery here, because we will be back here very soon. Now let's take a little stroll and get to know Glasgow Green, the oldest park in the city. I can't emphasize enough how fortunate we were with the weather as just on the drive up here from Leeds we were hit with rain and flooded roads. Maybe Rocky did a little sun dance. We found a pretty cool view over here of the city and we also found an amazing blue bridge which overlooks the River Clyde, the second longest river in Scotland. The park was huge and we spent more than an hour or so just walking around and we simply found the Templeton building to help us get us back to where we started. This time we took a closer look at this marvelous building. Next up, we made our way to the Kelvin Grove Art Gallery and Museum. And this was just yet another building that was magnificent and it's right next to the River Kelvin. Right next to the museum stands a beautiful park, the Kelvin Grove Park. We had read a sign that said there was a duck pond, so I was quite determined to find it. Now, this was a smaller park than Glasgow Green, but it was still gorgeous, and with the autumn season in full swing, the park was just a feast for the eyes. Now, let's go find that duck pond. There they are, enjoying the Scottish weather, just like everyone else. We also visited the Kelvin Grove Museum and Art Gallery in the evening and we did some more nighttime sightseeing in Glasgow. A very beautiful city indeed. Now, before we go to our bully walk, I just wanted to take a moment and reflect. Rocky wasn't always the most dog friendly dog. He's had dog friends before, but he's always been more of a person's dog. But traveling around in big cities like Barcelona, he got to meet tons of dogs everywhere and he got friendlier. I guess he saw that they weren't that bad. Our last adventures in Spain gave me the confidence to take him to this bully walk and he's come a long way. So for me, it was a great joy to see him make all these friends. Now let's go. We found our new bully friends and Rocky quickly made himself as part of the bully pack. Our walk took us to a familiar place, the dog-friendly West End Brewery in the Templeton building where Bull Terrier Mania took over. 
There were about 16 awesome Bull Terriers all in, and Rocky was super excited to meet them all. Now I'm going to briefly let the person who invited us, Glasgow Bull Terrier Club's Emily Devine, to do some narration. Well, I had never seen Rocky's tail wax so much and for so long. He was right at home with his bully brothers and sisters. It was a memorable experience for us as we had never done something like this before and I had always wished that I could take Rocky to a Bull Terrier event. So it was a dream come true. I had met so many bullies and so many lovely locals who were curious to meet Rocky the Traveler. Each of these little bullies had their own little personalities and it was such a joy to meet them all. I still couldn't believe we were here. The Bull Terrier Club had set up a photo shoot to commemorate this cool day and so it was time for Rocky to shine. Along the way he made really good friends with Bull Terriers Casper and Luna. The trio became peas in a pod. Rocky was ready for his shoot at Classy Dog Studios in Glasgow. After all, he is a pro with the camera. Emily was pretty good at getting the trio's attention. Check out her barking skills. The entire shoot was a blast and yet again another awesome experience in Glasgow. When it came to it, Rocky showed the photographers his skills and they were pretty impressed with his posing skills. They even said he was the most well-behaved dog they had ever seen. Of course, food and treats always help. Now, it was Rocky, Luna and Casper, the three little pigs. Guys, thanks for watching and special thanks to the Glasgow Bull Terrier Club and Classy Dog Studios. What an amazing experience and we'll see you guys soon.